because you can see the icon. You know, so there's the Nook icon, so you know that's uh, an app from, uh, from the Nook shop. But whereas Temple Run 2, I downloaded that from Google Play uh, app, and there isn't that icon. So that's the way to differentiate. There's the shop, um, you know, Google Play shop uh, on the active screen uh, of the home page, uh, or that shelf on the home page. Uh, but then you can see the individual pieces of content from the, the Nook shop here, where there's a movie, uh, a book, uh, a couple newspapers, um, in terms of uh, in terms of whatever you want. Now the as we were talking about before, from an experience standpoint, uh, the uh, apps look beautiful and really leverage this you know the gorgeous display and uh, the processing power. It's a popular game that, that, that had loaded up. Real yeah, another one. Yeah. Again, they look spectacular mm -hmm. uh, on the device, uh, and uh, and now we have avail you know over seven hundred thousand apps available through Google Play, in addition to all the great, amazing content uh, that we have. Uh, web browsing, again, as I said, we have uh, the Chrome browser um, and uh, you know sites like ESPN. And when you log you in the can, first time, you get to take the tour. And your multiple tabs. So just playing around with multiple tabs mm -hmm. uh, on there, and then you know, but then there's you know, access to other CBS Sports mm -hmm. and other content. But then the individual pieces of content, like Sports Illustrated or National Geographic Kids, uh, are directly from the Nook Store. You can see the individual pieces mm -hmm. of content and the value proposition. Having that all in one place uh, is uh, still there. And then you've got your library. And you can see that there's a little Nook, mm -hmm. um, little Nook logo button on there so you know which ones are coming from Nook and which ones are coming from Google. The one, the one thing we did in the library, uh, which you could see here, is you know, these are all the books that you've purchased uh, or downloaded through Nook. Here are the magazines. Here are the individual movies. But we do have um, on apps uh, from a customer standpoint. We've downloaded a lot of apps here. You know, the individual apps have, you know, we do organize those mm -hmm. for the customers uh, in the apps section of the library. Uh, and then the Google Play shop icon is there, as you can see. And then, you know, kids and catalogs and newspapers and the other offerings that we have are all integrated mm -hmm. still without any changes. So it's really, a, you know, the, from a value standpoint, um, you know, we've really layered in uh, Google Play on top of, uh, the experience that we know that our consumers uh, really like. Here's access to music, which we think is a big mm -hmm. enhancement mm -hmm. and, and something that adds tremendous value uh, to what we have uh, currently. You know, shop millions of songs uh, there. Did we talk about Google um, Music? Uh, Just give me <laughs> I got. It. I just picked the best song, the most popular song on the list. I gotta pick some better, different music.